Oh look, it looks like we've got an eclipse going on or something here. It's getting darkish outside too. I wonder if we'll spawn anything. Weird. Didn't know that was a thing. Um, well, anyways, um, so these guys went through and we got some commons and another cultivated. But since I'm not generating... Ooh, what's happening here? This is cool. Gen generating any honey, I can't analyze them. So we're going to do something about that. But let's watch the eclipse first. Are these like rare, common? Am I going to die? Get struck by lightning? What do you do? It's very pixelated too, because of course it's Minecraft 16 bit. Or is this even 16? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. It looks like it's 8 by 8 sun in the middle there. Weird. It's very dark outside. Very, very dark. I think this is as full as it's going to get, perhaps. Oh no, my notifications. Let me turn those off. Go away. Perfect. We're back. Okay. Very dark out here. I don't know if I want to deal with this. That looks cool, though. My res render distance is so low. Things plug in. Well... Let's see, do we see the light level? 15 is the sky, but I think it even says that at night, so. I'm not sure it actually knows. Okay, sun's coming back up. That was interesting. But uh, anyways, let's see here. Yeah, we're making a lot of seed oil, actually faster than my farm can keep up, I'm pretty sure. Uh, let's get some more, more wood in there. But I think the plan I'm gonna have here is make a bunch more apiaries because I wanna get as much honey as possible. So we've got, yeah, let me in. We've got 15 of these pristine rocky princesses, which don't produce many combs, and I think their cones don't produce much honey, but might as well get those going. And Valiant, I think, does produce a lot. I'm not going to even play with this guy yet, but he's ignoble like the rest of these, and I'm going to ignore those for now until I can figure out what best to do with them. But so what I'm going to do now is hope that these guys here give me a couple combs so I can do some analyzing. But while they wait, oh. I think these were paused because it was, quote, nighttime. Interesting. I think I saw something there for a second. But I'm going to make a bunch of these uh, impregnated casings to make a bunch of apiaries, which uh, is just, it's a bunch of wood, basically. And uh, hopefully, with the addition of that many more bees, we can get some more honey at a faster rate. So this is going to get used up pretty thoroughly. I might expand my farm a bit as well. But um, yeah. Might need to look into some better storage here too, but I mean, I get as much as I need just by cutting down these trees constantly, but don't have much storage. So I can't plop in all my wood and just save it all because it's going to store this up. Anyways, um, I'm going to get to that and I'll be back. Might as well record while we're doing this, so make these up here. They use a lot of the seed oil, I think, yeah, a quarter bucket per, so we've got a fair amount in here and we're going to have to get some more seeds, but I can just start transferring. Since that's what all the seed oil is for anyways. I think that does it. So now here, we can make another 17, which is about perfect, actually. And here, we're, we're almost to another quarter bucket, but uh, these seeds are going to run out soon. So now we've made a couple of these, so I can go over here, and actually, we'll probably need to chop down some more trees. But um, now let's chop one down real quick, because I don't have any, any planks. I put them all in that guy. But um, just chop this down real quick, get some more wood. It's one of the very nice things about this mod, the trees just drop so fast that I get all the saplings and it's, it's kind of great. Uh, these, how are these going? These are empty. Okay, so what we're gonna do is we're going to get, I think this is enough, yeah, that's perfect, amount of slabs. Then I can put these here. I wonder what that is, hold up. Drying rack, interesting. I wonder what mod that's for. Actually, it probably tells me, huh? Tinkers, okay. Yeah, I feel like I've seen that before. I have played with Tinkers many moons ago. And there's two more apiaries. So I can just start laying those out here and put in some more bees. And we will be good to go. And they're just cranking through these. So yeah, getting set up. Got a, well, this wood's almost out actually, but uh, Saplings burn so fast, but I can put those in too. It's a good use of 
the saplings because they just, they just get used up, but they do give you a lot of energy. All right, we're back. We got all that done. We got a few amount of seed oil left, but not too much, so which is kind of perfect. Um, <clears throat> excuse me, let me get you out of the way. Um, so over here, we basically got uh, 15, our 15 pristine Rocky Princesses, and then we got the one Valiant um, Prince princess and drone we had over there and we already got three of these rocky combs i don't know how good these are so let's check them out you can obviously make stuff with them oh interesting is a bee house the same as an apiary i wonder i have to look into that because that's cheaper to make of course once you have combs but yeah 25 percent of a honey trap so that's that's not ideal but we can break this put it here because we're no longer using power to convert any uh, of these things. We can place that guy there, spin him, and start empowering. We got some power, perfect. So I can place these through and they should start going. Now let's, let's see if we get lucky, get any honey drops. Still don't know exactly what happens here. Sometimes they're getting one stuck here that even if you power it, it won't do anything. But um, what time is it? It's getting night. Okay, well, let's pick up this. How's power? Let's see. Oh, we got at least one. Okay, let's head to sleep and see if we can get two in the morning. Uh, but I think even though Rockies don't produce that many combs and their combs aren't that great, putting all 15 pristines out there we have will be very helpful uh, in getting enough honey to actually get some pure bees that produce a lot of honey. So let's check it. Okay, one's not bad. Yeah, sometimes this happens. I don't fully understand what's happening here. This is storing power, so I'm gonna turn it off. And yeah, this is no longer using any power whatsoever. Got all these trees, I'll cut them down when I need them. Um, let's see, because I can just go through here. I'm just bringing these to get a bunch of drones. Every once in a while I'll get combs. I've actually never gotten a comb from this apiary because I've never gotten one of those uh, the mundane combs, I believe they're called. But I can go through here, check them out. I believe these guys only produce one drone per time right now, so we won't gain an excess, but that's fixable later with the whole DNA stuff. Okay, I think that's two more combs. And I think these guys do produce a fair amount. But I haven't seen any yet. But, like, these are rare. It's like, I feel like it's in the hour range and how long... It was like three hours or eight hours or something crazy like that. All right, let's see. Because if we can get two honey, then we'll be set for... I'll just compare like these two guys um, and breed these up. And then I'll just guess over here and I'll probably just combine these. Start getting some cultivated and stuff. Two, perfect. Could be more, but two is fine enough for now. So let's check these out. And actually, I'll probably wait, get off camera some more honey and check those out. But here we've got a common forest. Okay. And this guy is a common cultivated. Interesting. Okay, you know what? I'm going to just keep doing this and get some more honey and slowly get the rest of these guys analyzed. Um, these two, I don't fully know what they are right now, but I'm not going to worry about them. I'm just going to keep breeding this guy with these drones and these this guy with any meadows stuff and see if we can get uh, purebred. Um, but yeah, so I'm gonna just keep going through collecting all the uh, these rocky combs, which are actually surprisingly more common than I expected. Way more common than honey combs from the forest bees. Then again, there are 15 of these. But I've already collected like nine cones or something. One, two, three, four, five, six. Ah, uh, six. Ah, uh, seven. So getting pretty crazy and yeah i wonder yes yeah, so the the type of wood you use must make a difference these must be like officially spruce and i guess the maybe birch or something because these are all oak wood but they look very different than the ones i got from the villager but yeah so very jumpy episode today but that's because it's been many days for me of recording this not doing too much at one time i missed it this dude you can see his particles he literally shot a, a, a pit Pigeon? Really? Shot chicken. You shall pay for your injustices to the chicken race. It's okay. I've got you. I'm 
totally going to get your friend. But I got you. Got an arrow in my arm. That was weird. Where is it? Oh. Oh, it really is just sticking out of the bottom of my hand there. Wow, this guy got me a fair amount. I was mostly just trying to push record, but... Because he killed a chicken. But yeah, he got me right in the hand. That must have hurt. The one on my shield, fine. But the one in the back of my hand right there. Oof. Well, I'm just doing some exploring for beehives here, but I found another village. And geez, all of these are noble, I find. All of them. Uh, so... Well, I have a video now of where the coordinates are, so don't need to really worry about that. Let me just check to see if my video is actually running. Yep, okay. Yeah, <laughs> don't, don't want to lose those coordinates for sure. Interesting, what are you? Rice. Hmm. A lot of plants here. Hops. Except for, like, alcohol or something? Probably. What does pick up? Hops. Interesting. I think I have some of this already. I'm going to throw it out. Don't have too much inventory space. But let's see. Do we have another mm. apiarist? Get this dude. Don't know what's happening in there. I'll have to check that out. Some later date when I'm ready for more advanced stuff. Let's see. We got these grass paths. They look pretty cool. I do say so myself. There's a villager. Oh my, leg spike. That's what happens when you explore the world. Though I haven't had one that was this large for quite a while. Treated. Interesting. Immersive engineering. Wonder what this guy is. Outfitter. Weird. What's up, dude? Is there the APRS, though? That's what I'm kind of curious about here. Hello. I might have to steal one of you in my boot farm. Yes. Uh-oh. Here's zombies. Pretty sure I already grabbed some pumpkins, but it's been a while. Um, so yeah, I don't think there was a apiarist in this village, but that's okay. We'll check it out another time. I'll run away before night so it doesn't despawn. Let's see if we get anything from this that's pristine. Nope, they're noble. These are the ones I really need, though. I don't have any except for that hybrid thing I'm trying to make pure. But um, getting these honeycombs, that's actually a, a nice bonus. <laughs> Because the stuff I have right now just doesn't really produce honey at a reasonable rate. So I'm going to keep exploring. But that was pretty cool. I swear I just broke a Meadows Hive. Because I have two drones now. And I didn't get a princess, but I, I really thought I saw it. I thought I saw two bees. Is it in this bag? I'm pretty sure that the, those are just like a glowstone and nether quartz. Oh, I hit my microphone. That was probably loud. I'll have to cut that out there. Um, but yeah. Did not get a princess, which is a little annoying because I'm really looking for a pristine mess. Yes, I am. I totally thought of a name for my sheep in my vanilla as well, so we'll have to do that. You'll have to check out that coming video soon. The fire department is burning down the, the bayou. It's a precious land here. Can't be burning this. I guess there must be a lava. Wonder how far that's gonna spread. I'm gonna, I'm gonna despawn this area. I think. Hopefully it doesn't. Oh, it's gonna catch this tree as well, isn't it? Oh my, it's lagging my game as well. Well, hopefully that all goes out because I hope this doesn't all burn down. It looks pretty neat here. I might come back at some point. But um, yeah, that tree's definitely going up. Well, it might survive actually. Well. We'll see. Sun's going down. I want to hurry home. Only got one more hit left in the... Uh, what is this called? Scoop. That I have, so... Oh, wow, that's neat. But yeah, back we go. Hello. You guys are blue. I'm blue, too. But I'm not quite as blue. Oh, did I kill him? Oh, we're good. I can, uh... You know. You can take a selfie, dude. There we are. Hello. Thumbnail time. I'm going to take a bench. I've been having issues where my screenshots are so black sometimes, so let's hope that didn't happen. These are stacking now, so I think we did it. Uh, we might have actually gotten a pristine Meadows Princess from breeding, but um, from all those honey I, honeycombs that I got, we did get two pristine princesses. I think I got like a modest or unusual maybe one of these, and... Uh, 
one more of the forest and we should be able to get some honey here but let me just quickly just check see we got those are empty right oh gosh lag coming back oh it looks like this one might be purebred finally as well so that was nice timing uh, and including the forest we have inside we now have three forests and one meadows these don't produce much especially since i was unloading these chunks pretty much the entire time i was here though i was here during the night a bit and the rockies do work at night so who knows we got some sugar from the valiant bees just check them all but the honeycomb should probably be done processing now be able to check some things out not quite let that run a bit more just generating some more fuel here i was looking into the mf mfe which about the that requires some macerators and stuff i have not set up yet so we'll probably do that oh wow that was big next episode or so something like that we'll see i've looked in my file i've got a lot of clips for this one very short clips but like 10 or plus of them so it's gonna be a choppy episode but as i said for me it's been a choppy choppy recording session as well um, so again some cultivates i forgot that i had a pure common drone in there um, so these these are both common forests i think this is common forest this is a common cultivated so we'll see what to do with that but um now that we've got this all set up i'm going to oh this should oh not quite i still don't fully understand when this is done um, see sometimes it goes through twice but then i don't think i'll actually get anything from it i think i'm just wasting rf oh i did weird i don't understand but um we got six here so let's let's analyze these two and you might as well analyze uh the cultivated and the forest these um we already have and these are like old stuff and i already know that this is common common so let's check it out so we've got a forest forest here okay he's got some different fertility traits but that's about it forest forest as well forest common okay now let's see about these cultivated bees so we've got a cultivated forest and another cultivated forest and actually let's let's move all these out over here uh so here's just the where's the common common okay that one's pretty nice so this one is uh, six generations in captivity oh yeah it's forest forest oh it tells you those things now interesting um, and this one five so this is common forest and i believe these are all forest commons right here uh combination of the two and these are cultivated forests so we'll figure out what to do with those later common cultivated and this is just a straight forest drone okay so this princess let's mix it with let's let's just mix it let's yeah because I, I don't want to get cultivated i do want to have at least one pure common so let's mix it with this common drone um let's check them out do their stats look the same so that's like shorter slowest slower two and that's definitely different pollination but maybe we can at least get commons and then make the traits the same every time later and then this one we can try to get to cultivated so i can take this common cultivated and the hopefully the common can make a cultivated trap maybe the cultivated trap will just take over there because i don't believe a hive and a cultivated do anything so i'm going to put this one here and this one here and we will see what happens i'm going to put it right here cool and yeah these are all going could also use some of these getting a lot of ex excess drones here but yeah, so gonna keep bringing these up. I'll let you guys know when this is back. I might look at the recording length of this video too and cut, but gonna try to make some progress. Maybe get a pure one or both of these at some point in this episode, but we'll, we'll see how long that takes. Well, geez, we just keep finding villages and things. I mean, I am exploring, but I'm not going that far. You know, another 400 blocks from the place. There's like three within a 500 block circle, but I'm not complaining. Now we have all sorts of villagers we can then trap. I wonder what this guy is yes we can check once again if we have a apiarist villager this is a fairly large one too at least it's spread out oh that might be one we'll see uh 
Recording while generating terrain. Wouldn't recommend. Doesn't work very well. What's up, dude? What type of villager are you? Does it tell me? Oh, Fletcher. You work just fine for crops, though. In just the brown coat ones, it doesn't matter if they're a farmer or a Fletcher or whatever. Who is this? Forestry? Yes. Aha! Perfect. Now, what do we have here? Wow, this guy, this goes really far. So here we got a, a forest queen, pristine. And another one that's also pristine, which is pretty dope. I'm going to steal your stuff, dude. Uh, and um, some more apiaries, which is pretty nice. What type of door is this? Maple. Cool. But yeah, so you still need to get a meadows pristine. Jeez, how hard can it be? What do you have to sell? Stringy comb for wheat. Ooh. Ooh, we want you. We're going to come steal you at some point soon. Oh, yes, yeah, so many honeycombs. And what are these? Oh, come on, come on. Pristine and pristine. Oh, this is perfect. Can I pick it all up? Grafter. Uh, what do I not need? I don't need these. I don't need sticks. Silver lime sapling. Don't really need a chest. Uh, what else can I throw away? I don't need apples. I get a million of those. Okay, well, I guess I'm heading home, because I just filled up my inventory. Uh, but we can make a lot of honey now, so that's great. So, I don't know what's up here. It's a huge village, huge village, but I'm going to head back. What am I talking about? I don't know where I got him. I really thought... Oh, there must have been... Was there a third one I just didn't see in the chest? But now we got one. And, of course, we... I think we have one from the last apiarist uh, we visited back in episode one, in which we finally managed to make pre pur purebred. Jeez, excuse me. So, got a couple meadows. Got like five or six forests now with all the ones we have back at home. Oh, great, Richie. Anything under here? Not this one. Sometimes I think there's spider spawners and loot. Good thing there isn't, though, because I can't actually grab any more loot as it is right now. Um, yeah, there's a lot of cool things when you go exploring. A lot of bad guys, too, even during the day. I ran into, like, a clump of creepers on my way out. Like, you know, not even nighttime. Let's see, though. Yeah, there's a lot of a lot of beehives everywhere. You go exploring. If you want just forest meadows, unusual, any of the commonish ones. Of course, there's more rare ones, like water and snow. You gotta be in snowy biomes for snow, of course. But yeah, so... Yeah, because these, these guys are everywhere. They do blend in pretty well, too. But I'm going to not stand near them so they don't bite me. Sting, I think, would probably be a more appropriate word. But that's what's supposed to be happening. All right. Getting almost there. I think I need to go a little bit this way. Well, hello. You're all fancy. Gold armor. And we got one with a chain. Oh, lag. Don't do that to me. No drops? Okay, can you drop something for me? Please, thank you. Oh, lag. Die! Did I get anything? Oh, I can't pick it up, but it's just bones and arrows. Not worth. I swear there was another dude here. Oh, hi. Hi there. I'm just going to slay you real quick. Thank you. Okay, well, we're going to ignore all these fools. Jeez. Do they spawn from this thing? Oh, gosh. Don't kill me. Gotta, gotta not die. I'm just going to stop recording, but, like, they almost killed me. Oh, my. I don't have an, a bow yet. Run! Oh, well, there's another Meadows Hive. Leave me alone. A lot of bad guys right there for the middle of the day. Well, now that we survived that, I'm just going to head home.